So this is what the world looks like when it rains. This is the consequences of not having a good gutter or drainage system whilst you're building. This happens when the gutters that are available are blocked and so the rains have nowhere to go. This is deep. This is deeper than you think because it's you can see where the road starts from down there. So it's deep. And this is what we had to face yesterday. That was the first rain of the year. And it wasn't so heavy as such. But this was the aftermath. Now think about where it rains consecutively for seven days or more. Please, when constructing your houses, ensure that you have a good drainage system. It wouldn't cost you so much to do that. Now look at the gutters, they are filled to the brim with dirt and everything, so the water cannot pass. These are on two different days, when it rained and when it didn't rain. So now you see the difference. This is the same exact road, the same location. Two cars like one car and then one truck actually got bad like they stopped on the road i mean when you're done drinking this when the vehicle is done drinking this water what else do you expect see the other aa rhino car is there it's also trapped it can't move i think it broke down something so that's the aftermath of all this for everything there's a consequence and we the masses get to suffer the most <sighs> The water everywhere. See the car thing. See, see the road. See how bad the road is. See? So yeah, it rained yesterday for the first time. Yesterday was the yesterday was the twelfth day of um, January twenty twenty one, and yeah. The rains are here, I guess. And actually, this is my first time seeing it rain in January. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. It's 2021, and we're doing the most. We're being intentional about everything. So yeah, I'm going to for my first vision board class, and I'm going to take you guys along with me and show you guys everything I get up to. Where it's really calm today, and things are in top gear. And yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm ready for the year. The only bare minimum I'm going to allow in my life in 2021 is my makeup. Vetro um, vision board class and it was organized by my secondary Girl. school classmate she is topping the chat and I'm so proud of her so first we had to write about our 2020 accomplishments and here I was writing everything top of my list was also starting my youtube channel staying alive and also meeting incredible people it was a brainstorming session as well. We're allowed to like talk about the things we liked about our 2020 and the things we hope to change 2021. And I felt really happy with the whole session. Like it gives you the strength. And it also gave me an opportunity to advertise my brand Z on demand. Z E E on demand. Please follow her. We're looking for subscribers. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so I'm not a pro, so I'm just gonna give you like a few rundown with everything you need to do a virtual um, vision board. So we use the Canva, 
it's an app that helps with people use it for even thumbnails so you go there and you insert vision board and it gives you like a template that you could use to create your own yeah your own vision board and then you could use the pixby to insert pictures like what we're doing here so for instance um she wanted something right she wanted to travel more this year she wanted to get into a good relationship this year she wanted to be able to cook more this year and do other stuff so that was basically what um she used the canva to do she went to um, the place got pictures the kind of pictures that she wanted from the pics bay and you insert what you want right you can insert travel and then you see all sorts of things there and then you insert it right into the picture where you want everything to be and like that like that you create your own vision board and that was basically all we did at this session so i actually would go for a virtual vision board because i feel that it goes everywhere with me and it constantly and it constantly reminds me of um, my plans for the year as opposed to having just um some sheet of paper hanging on my wall in my room and i'm only reminded when i'm there so my vision board for this year is my um laptop screensaver my phone screensaver so i'm constantly reminded i'm constantly put on notice that these are the things that i envisage to happen this year it helps me to plan my life and to align myself with my thoughts hoping that somehow somewhere my plans my thoughts all align with god's plan for my life so i think this works better for everyone because i mean we're all going virtual these days everything is being done virtually and i'm also a virtual person right so i feel if you're a virtual person this will actually work for you in particular so this was me creating my vision board as you can see um i'm very 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 interested in growing my brand here on youtube this year i plan to grow bigger and better i plan to improve my content as well so this was the thing we used in classes was it she planned to travel more to study more and do everything so this is what i did i wanted to travel more i wanted to get into i, I wanted to travel more do everything align myself with myself and um, the food, um, the I wanted to eat more fruits, exercise, just live healthy, and I also wanted to take my YouTube seriously this year. So this was me creating my vet, um, virtual vision board, and I enjoyed. Every day, every day, every day, every day, the big document, the equal APT agreement I'm about to sign in January of how many million naira I gave it to her to review, yeah. and she did a perfect job. Like when I gave it to a senior lawyer and told him some stuff. But what I could do, I said I gave it to one of my lawyer friends to read for me. That's a wow. wow. I also want to thank you for my one. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this one. And yeah, I thought to just share with you what the city of over looks like when it rains and when it's not raining. So you can see that we have a lot to do as regards the drainage system in Nigeria in general. And you know, we're like, the government has a lot to do and we as citizens also have a lot to do please dispose your refuse or your beans properly and your waste properly because if the gutters or the drainages are filled nothing can pass and the water will be obstructed and that is how we have um flood coming up do you understand and with the changing times you never can tell the velocity otherwise of the rains this year so it's good to put yourself on check and to ensure that your environment is at least at the barest minimum it's safe for you and your family and your kids you don't want to go from work to your house and then you find out that your house is flooded and everything is lost as well um I went for a virtual class and I thought to share with you. So if you want to create a vision board, it's not too late. It helps you. It constantly reminds you of all that you thought um, to plan or all that you thought to execute as the year comes to, as we start a fresh year, right? So I thought to bring that to your attention and to let you know that um, it's not too late to create a virtual um, board right now. And yeah. So that's all I really wanted to show you in this video. So if you loved it, please um, 
give this video a thumbs up share subscribe and most importantly do not miss my art so see like come your way next time do well to stay love do well to stay safe max up and be safe subscribe while that's it okay bye